to sit on Bella's telephone. It's such a spine-tickling experience. <laughs> hey, just what I need. Hair remover. Not that kind of hair. <laughs> Drac, let me show you my new hi-fi. Well, what do you know? Stereophonic sound. Say, what's for dinner, Agatha? Oh, my favorite dish, squash. Come on, you cats. I'm gonna lay on you like how to play baseball. Actually, I don't care for a sport in which the object is to hit the bat. Wait, I shall go get the spray gun. I love catching flies. Man, I can see this will not be as easy as I had thought. Now, the game starts like when a pitcher gets the hand signal from the catcher, you dig? It's a knuckleball. There goes the pitch. The batter picks up his bat. Whoops! Wrong bat. Every baseball game needs a vampire. And now it is into the batter's box. And here comes the pitch. Oh, it's gonna be close to running his lights. <laughs> Safe, man. Now to head for second. I needed that. Looks like the runner here is in trouble. Now there's a lucky break. But the second baseman got a hand on the ball and tosses it to third. I'd like this better if it was a double-header. And the third baseman throw the ball home. As you can see, it's easy to get wrapped up in a baseball game. Frankie, that baseball game tired you all out. Well, you just relax while Hagatha reads you the story of Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Oh, goody, 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 goody. Once upon a time, there was a cute little girl named Goldilocks who came upon a cottage in the woods. Oh, my, what a cute little cottage. 
And looky over there. Three bowls of porridge. I just love porridge. Oh, that one's too hot. And that one's too cold. Oh, now that one's just right. <laughs> now for some shot eye. Ah, this one's too hard. And this one's too soft. Ah. Mummy bear. What else could I be? <laughs> you know. <laughs> hey, Dick. Someone sleeping in my bed. It is like the biggest doll I have ever seen. Also the ugliest. Whoa. Uh, what's going on here? And it talks. I wonder if it eats too. Oh boy. Do I? Bring more porridge. Bring more porridge. Quick, Mummy, more porridge! Make more porridge! And from the day Goldilocks moved in, the three bears worked like dogs! More porridge! Bring more porridge! That talking and eating doll is gonna drive us right into the poor house, you know! That's the one thing it can't do is drive! For a family of bears, this is a grizzly end! <laughs> and they all live Horribly ever after. <laughs>
Now, it's weird. Window time. Drac, what do you take in your coffee? Just a little sugar and vanishing cream. <laughs> Wolfie, do you know why Hagatha dropped out of witch's school? Yeah, because she like flunked spelling. You show me a ghost who holds a college campus, and I'll show you the old school spirit. Ah, uh, my favorite plant. An ever-loving passion flower. Look what I cooked, Sabrina. Oh, Scream of Vampire Soup. Where did you get that recipe, Agatha? From the Batty Croker cookbook. <laughs> I wonder what is wrong with Orville. He's not his usual healthy green. <laughs> Just as I thought, he is suffering from spring fever. Wow, my favorite flower. A black-eyed Susan. A uh, Asket Casket. Did you hear the Ghostly Glee Club concert? Yes, they sang a haunting melody. Oh, my favorite flower. A tiger lily. Hey, Bella, what's my horoscope for today? Ah, uh, the stars say that a treasure will soon befall you. Do the stars really say that? Ask them yourself. I see by the old spooko clock that it's time to break for lunch. Oh, my favorite flower. Snap, dragon. <laughs> hey, Ratso, where does Drax spend Saturday night? <laughs> That's easy, Batso, in his bathtub. Drag baby, what would you like for dinner? Alpha bat scoop. What else? Here we are at the Dracula dingy dungeon. Better step lively. It closes at five. Sharp! This is where we keep the family mementos. For instance, here we have my great aunt, Queen Draculana the First. They say I have her teeth. And I wish you'd give them back. I haven't had a bite in centuries. And here we have a distant blood brother. Chief Sitting Bat. Pale face speak with forked tongue. Me tired of sitting, going to fly. Fly? Why not? Me got reservation. <laughs> I'll bet he's in the Abache tribe. In here we have my cousin, Sir Goulahan. Hmm. Looks like Sir Goulahad's having a night out. Watch out, Drac, baby! Hi, Drac. Like, man, it's always nice bumping into you. You furry fathead! How am I going to get out? Sir Goulahad has the only key. Then it is simple. You has only to wait for one night. Woo -wee 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 -wee. Bella the ghostly spooking. Got a problem? Tell it to Bella, fella. Uh, what's that? You're a ghost. And your wife just came back from the hospital with a bouncing baby crib sheet? Uh, but he doesn't look like either of you? Hmm. My advice is take him back to the hospital. It's obvious you don't have the right spirit. <laughs> Bella sure doesn't have to advise us on how to get into mischief. Right, Ratso? <laughs> right, Ratso. <laughs> Look, Wolfie's fixing his wolf wagon. <laughs> what a chance to swipe his surfboard. <laughs> hey, let me out of here, here. Let me out of here. Sounds like Wolfie's got a knock in his engine. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Last one in is a rotten dinosaur egg. <laughs> this is more fun than a barrel of scorpions. Why, those ruffians have stolen Wolfie's surfboard. I'll fix them. <laughs> Now to return this to its rightful owner and collect the handsome reward. Oops! Help! I can't stop! So you're the surfboard snatcher, man. I'll teach you, buddy. Looks like Hauntleroy got his reward in the end. Sipes, am right. Ah, <laughs> Lord, I want my mommy. Ow! Now to check my tarantula turnovers. Tarantula turnovers? Why, that's my very favorite food. Are they done yet, cousin Hagitha? I said I'd call you when they're ready. Now stay out of my kitchen. Frankie is always getting under my skin. Funny, he never gets on the mine. I'd better check the oven. Are they done yet? Oh, are they done yet? I told you before, stay out of my kitchen. I tell you, he's driving me batty. Welcome to the club, my dear. Now for a touch of pepper in my cobweb casserole. Are they done yet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You overgrown ox! Look what you've done! Now I'll have to defrost some frozen fossils. Oh! Frozen fossils! Hey, oh! I dig, I dig! That is like my favorite food! When's it gonna be ready, huh? When is it gonna be ready? Oh, no! Not again! Today's guest group is the Rolling Headstones. Who's their leader? Man, like they got no leader. Ain't you heard the old saying? A rolling headstone gathers no boss. A roo woo! <laughs> Midnight comes in the middle of the night. Midnight is scary when you turn out the light. All the monsters come out at midnight. Ha ha! Hee hee! Whoa ho ho! At midnight! Everybody knows when the sun goes down. That's when the ghosts and the scary folks all start coming around. They're all waiting for the magic hour. That's when they shout and they jump about. Strikes twelve in the old church tower. Midnight comes in the middle of the night. Midnight is scary when you turn out the light. All the monsters come out at midnight. Ha ha! Whoa ho ho! At midnight! Every ghoulie's birthday is at midnight. They sing this tune by the light of the moon. Out of sight. You should see them play. It is such a fright. But they're all gone. They are never around by the break of day. One o'clock, two o'clock, three o'clock, four are exactly like the one before. Five through eleven are all alike. But things are different at midnight. Uh, 
light. All the monsters come out at midnight. Ha ha, tee hee. 